uh, we had so much stormy weather over the last several days, bringing that much needed rain, but at the same time causing a lot of problems. But yesterday, things quieted down and started to warm up. In fact, it was uh, hovering in the 80s uh, across the majority of the state, a little cooler than that at Logan. It was 76 there, upper 90s in St. George, but in Salt Lake, we hit 82. Uh, today we're going to be warming up. In fact, our average high temperature is 90 and we'll end up hovering uh, pretty close to that, if not hitting it right on the mark. Now we're starting out uh, near 70 degrees in Salt Lake City this morning, 10 degrees lower than that in Lehigh. It's in the mid 50s in Logan, 57 in Park City, uh, cool 49 in Elko. Otherwise, most of us are starting out in the 50s and 60s. Uh, and we're drying out. We've got a few spotty showers, mainly over some of the higher terrain in Grand County, south of uh, I-70, and those won't last very long. Otherwise, we've got fair skies out there, and that's made for a pretty nice view of the full moon this morning. Scott Taylor was nice enough to take this photo and send it in to us. Uh, real treat to see that, especially after how smoky it's been. Now, we will get some more smoke moving in today. There's a trough of pressure dropping into the Pacific Northwest that's helping to maintain a southwesterly flow, but most of that smoke that drifts in from the California wildfires will be over northwestern Utah and the far north. The farther south you go, the better it's going to look. And with the southwesterly flow continuing, uh, we're going to stay dry for the next couple days at the very least. So a sunny day in Salt Lake with the high temperatures I mentioned, making it up to 90. It'll be in the upper 70s in Park City and Evanston. Uh, most valleys will be in the mid to upper 80s, warmer in Moab at 96, and in St. George, a high temperature of 98 degrees this afternoon. Now tomorrow, the smoke becomes more likely, patchy smoke becoming more widespread. Uh, otherwise, it'll stay dry in the south, sunny, and by the end of the week, getting even hotter. You'll make it all the way up to 104 in St. George on Thursday and Friday with overnight temperatures uh, by tomorrow morning and for the rest of the week covering near 70. And for Salt Lake City, patchy smoke tomorrow, otherwise sunny and near 90. Same thing on Wednesday. Uh, Weak storm is going to brush by on Thursday. That might bring a few isolated thunderstorms to the mountains of central and southern Utah, but otherwise we'll stay sunny in Salt Lake, cool off a little bit. Looks like mid-80s heading into the weekend.